Hello Mary, it's Friday and I'm filming on my side camera because I don't know where my SD card is. I think it's upstairs but I can't really be asked to go upstairs to find it. So yeah, you're gonna have a really crap video. We've just watched some guy um blow a marshmallow out of his nose and into some girl's mouth. It's really weird. Watching the Guinness the Watching the World Guinness no. Watching the Guinness World Records gone wild, which is really weird. A guy also like smashed 142 eggs with his face in a minute, which is just weird. He had a lot of egg on his head, but yeah. It's a really confusing program. There's a people on there are like, there was a woman and she was like smushing watermelons with her thighs and a guy just running through panes of glass. People are batshit crazy. In response to your video yesterday, you should ignore people yelling strange things at you in the street. I once had um, um, a chav yell out to me that I was motherfucking white trash. Um, I just kind of continued walking because they were wrong on all, all accounts. So, you know, I, I don't... Fuck mothers, I'm more pink in colour than white, and um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not rubbish. So, yeah, you should just ignore shit people who say shit things and just get on with your day. Really, don't let them affect it because the thing they said to you is going to be affecting their day, so you shouldn't really let them affect your day. This is my two cents on the matter. Because it's Friday and we said that Friday was going to be like inspiration day or thing that we thought was really cool during the week thing day. I'm going to talk about Dragon Quest for a minute because it's a really fun game. I never really played RPGs properly when I was little. I think the closest I got was Pokemon and I don't really know if you count that as an RPG. It's kind of. I don't know. But that was the closest I ever got and then Pokemon's mostly the only game really that I played I think as a kid. I played you know, games on the Dreamcast, like Crazy Taxi and Tomb Raider and I ran away from dad playing Dino Crisis because that shit was terrifying as a child. But I never really played other sort of types of games that we didn't have in the house that dad didn't buy. So Dragon Quest has shown me that I can actually play these kind of games and it's made me happy and yeah, excited. So I thought I would tell you that is the thing that I've been doing a lot of this week. Yeah. It's really fun. I've, I've changed, I'm, I'm a thief now, which is exciting. I'm like attacking people with claws and yeah, it's it's fun. Oh, this goes the guy and he's snot into someone's face. Oh, kind of like snot all over it and she's like eating the marshmallow. Ugh. It is really, really gross. Really, really gross. They failed their attempt though, he didn't snot the marshmallow fur enough. That is too bad, they've been practicing. Her boyfriend must think that she's really weird. Eating some other guy's snot marshmallow. Nom nom nom! My Nintendo fact for the video is that on the cover of the original Super Mario Bros, Mario is actually about to die. He like crashes into a stone wall over some lava and we all know that when that happens he then falls to his doom and then you have to like start the game again which is really annoying. So yeah, Mario is dying. He's not actually, you know, like being a good Mario on the front cover which is kind of foreboding to what most children then have had to put themselves through in the game. I suppose it's just, oh my goodness, someone is flipping backwards on a pogo stick. Bye, I'm gonna go watch the crazy pogo stick man.